Hey everybody, happy Tuesday. Pastor Matt here with your daily RPM. Hope you're having a great day. We're going to be continuing today on Matthew chapter 25, the parable of the talents. <laughs> Very simply this, uh, Jesus is teaching a master, a, a, we would say an employer or a, a businessman goes on a journey and leaves his three employees in charge. To one, he gives five talents, to another two, to another one. And the five and the two talents multiplied theirs. The one talent did nothing with it. Here's my point today. It was their choice what they did. God gives us a free will to do what we choose with our lives. You can do whatever you want with the giftings and talents God has given to you. I've met people who, it's like their favorite thing to tell me as a pastor. They say, oh, you don't have to go to church to be a Christian. You know what? The Lord will let you do that however you want to do it. Well, praise God, you don't have to do this to be a Christian. Well, praise God, I can sin and God's grace is going to cover me. God gives us free will. And as long as we're alive on this earth, you can do whatever you want to do. But the master is coming back. And even though he give he gave us a free will, just like with these people with the talents, he came back and held them accountable for what they did with their talents. And just like he's given us a free will, we can do whatever we want with the giftings, the talents, the callings, and the word of God. You don't have to follow it. You don't have to go to church. You don't have to do anything. You can live however you want to live. But the master is coming back. And when he does, we're going to have to give an account to him for how we lived. And I want to challenge you to be wise and realize I'm going to have to give an account and he expects me to be faithful and fruitful with the life that he's given me to live. I hope that blesses you and ministers to you today. God bless you. I'll see you tomorrow. If you like this video, like and share and follow my dad on Pastor Matt Ministries.